Hello everybody, this is Sonia. I'm back. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> okay, I've been gone. I'm sorry. I went and um, had a rest. <laughs> I didn't went anywhere. I just, I don't know, I just felt like I just needed a bit of a break for a while because, um, you know, being sick and everything, I needed to take some time off to just um, to, to feel better, <laughs> not to worry and stuff like that. So. I did worry all the time though because I hadn't put a video up but um, anyway so I'm here now today and I'm going to try and do something hard okay <laughs> let's do something a little bit hard not easy a lot of people put up videos and go oh this is really easy and they think oh well okay so it is but I always have to do something hard don't I? I can't even do anything that's not hard I can't help myself right now I've been playing around in here got glue all over me um, Got an idea, right? So I'm going to go with that. I'm going to go with the first idea. With the two, I've got a couple of ideas, so I'm going to show you how to do a few things. A couple of things this morning. Maybe I'll do two different videos though. Um, I've been. I looked at this paper here that I had uh, tore it out of those books. The ones that are in uh, Danish, and I think they're really nice papers. But the first thing I want to do is. Um, <laughs> I can't decide now, can I? There's two things. I can do both of them. So we'll go. We'll start somewhere, won't we? What did I do with? I had a pile of um, envelopes here somewhere, and I want to use an envelope. Actually, this is cool. It wasn't like the one I did earlier, so that's good. This is the way. This would be probably better than what I did earlier. I can just get one of them. I just need one of them. Okay, I'm not going to show you what I did before because I want to just, you know, we'll just, it'll be interesting as we go along, don't you worry, I promise, well I hope so, anyway, yes, it might work, I think it'll work, okay, so let's take it apart, I do like envelopes, I do like envelopes, I love making little tiny ones and I love using envelopes, so I hope these have all been good while I was gone, it'll be good now, <laughs> um, I feel so much better only for the last oh, probably two days I felt good because even yesterday I wasn't real smart those are okay whatever I had wrong with me and whatever Jeremy's got is really uh, testing us a bit I think he's, he's a lot better today he said so um, we had some sort of uh, flu thing um, or cold or you know the common cold it'll it'll really get you any time <laughs> it's, it's not good um so anyway i i've just not this is not working as good as i thought it'd be not coming apart very easy is it probably should melt the glue with the hot thing i don't want to do that i'm going to pull this apart it'll be fine i'm going to put paper on it so it should be solid when it's finished okay it'll still be solid when i've finished it Okay, you're right. So if yours aren't, uh, this is going really good together. If you wanted it to be, I suppose it wouldn't. That's how things go, though, isn't it? Look at that. <laughs> Anyhow, we're gonna we're gonna fix it. We'll fix it. We need the actual thing, or you can make your own. If you want to make your own, that's good too. You know, you can make your own envelopes. This is this obviously wouldn't have been hard to do if you, if you wanted to make your own. You just well, I'd. I have in the past used something like this as a template for, for a, a, to make an envelope. But what I'm, go I'm going to cover this with, you're not going to be able to see any of this, I don't think. So we're not going to be too worried about it. We shouldn't be able to see it. And all that will go back together anyway, so it'll still make it pretty sturdy, won't it? Plus there's going to be something over the outside. Right? Okay, so we're going to cover this now, because I think that's the next part. Um, before I go any further, I think I need to cover it first. Just, just making sure. I'm just trying to remember what I did before. It wasn't that long ago, but still, you know how things are. Now this is not very wide, is it? We still want to have the white bits on the end. Um, that's a shame. Did I get any more out of a big? I think I got a bit wider book. Let me see. I do like these pages. Oh no, that looks like it might be out of this one. Okay. 
I'm not going to worry about the white bit. Look, look, I'm not going to worry about the white bit. I want to, I want to put this on. I want to do it with this. So, you can use whatever, ever you want to to cover it. Anything you like. Okay. Now, I've got to work out that the front of the end. I want the front of it. By the time it closes up like that to be up the right way, so I've got to remember to do that properly. So I'm just going to cover this now with glue. Please stay here with me and go away. There. Righto. Glue. Yes. Mm, so, we had an okay Christmas. Me and Jeremy were by ourselves. We just had a... Oh, uh, small lunch. wasn't wasn't Christmas sort of lunch. Be, oh, he cooked us some vegetables and we had a little bit of ham. Oh, great. I put that up there so I'd know that pink stuff and now it's filling me. Um, it was all right. I'm waiting for my daughter to come visit me now because she couldn't come because of, we weren't well enough to, to have people here. You know, we weren't, we couldn't have entertained them and we didn't want them to be sick, them to get sick either. You know, because... These things aren't very good, anyway. So I had about, I had to turn in a couple of weeks nearly. Of this is so good, anyway. So, um, okay, so anyhow, I'm going to put this down on top of here. Straight as I can, sort of as best, of I, as, best as I can. And it doesn't matter if it doesn't go all the way over to these pieces because they're going to be tucked under and you're not going to be able to see them anyway are you so that'll be good all right i'm going to press this down don't know what to do about this little bit here yet but there'll be something you'll wait and see we'll find out how to fix that because the last one i made was a different shaped envelope the first one i've made the first and only one i've done was a different shaped one so now i'm going to cut around there You can put anything you like on this. You can decoupage it with some napkin. You can do a bit of music paper. But I just thought I'd like to use these ones here. I'm going to cut that a little bit off. It belongs to the envelope, but that's, you know, nobody's going to worry about that little bit. It's going to make it sturdy anyway, putting this paper on here. So I hope you see what I'm doing. And glue out there. Why didn't I get glue out there? Why is it curling up? I think it's because I've got the fan going on there and it might be drying too fast. So I don't know why it's curling up. Goodness, Sonia. <laughs> this has not happened to me before. <laughs> anyway, never mind. We're going to be good. Now we're going around the corner. Wait a minute, around the corner here. Around the corner down here. Right. Oh, yes, I got this the right way, haven't I? Yep. I did the first one, I did it, I put the paper on the wrong side, like on the inside instead of on the outside. And when I went to fold it, it was a little bit tricky to get folded back together because it didn't want to go that way, but I just pressed it down with the bone folder and so that worked all right. Now I've got glue here, and glue here, but I'm not going to worry about that for the time being. I'll just cut this bit off here. You move out of my way. I've got that sitting back up there with some things that I wanted to find later. Okay, so... Now, that's the front. Oh, hang on. Yes, did I do this wrong? This is the top. I might have done, you know. <laughs> I should have turned it down the other way, shouldn't I? Look at that, it's upside down. <laughs> Didn't I say? Not to, oh, that bit's where I need it to be the right way. Oh, I've done it. Look, that's the front of the envelope there. I did it. Okay. <laughs> Goody. <laughs> Right, now we're going to cut that. We're going to press that down, I should say. We're not going to cut anything at all. We're going to just press that over and just press that over. Okay. So we can put it back together in a minute. So now we have this. Right. Corners are not ducky, but I might leave them and I've got, I've got the cutting thing, so I'll cut that out later. So there's the front of your envelope look, and that's the part that goes down like that, so you've got your envelope. Just going to press that down with me bone folder because it doesn't seem to me to be going very, you know, because it's probably too wet too, is another thing. The glue's not dry properly, so it's... Okay. Yeah. Now get this bit here. Right, now, Santa Claus bought me some 
great things and amongst them I got a new cutting machine one that actually cuts out my dies without me winding it it's called a Gemini it's not in this room I now have a room to cut out stuff <laughs> it's up in the spare room on a, on a big table with me scan and cut and I had a lovely time the other day cutting out um, pieces uh, so I had a day doing that when I felt a bit better but we don't need one of them we can do it if we have one but we don't need one we're going to make a hole okay we're going to make a hole in here um, and I thought well y y we can do it easy I mean it's not hard to do we just need a size that we like and what did I use before I think I'd, it was a lid of something I think I used one of these little little pots maybe the lid size that's a bit big for this envelope because you've got to think you've got that there so I'm gonna make I'm gonna cut that out. So I need a little bit smaller, don't you reckon? If I had my dies in here, I would actually use aha. Uh -huh, that's a bit smaller, isn't it? Look, yes. I could have used my die just to draw around because I'm gonna show you how to do this. You don't need to have the die to do it with. So I'm gonna not actually center it because I think things look better if they're they're off center. I'm gonna draw a line around here. You only need to have a cutting mat and one of these little blokes and you must be very careful when you're doing this okay so I'm getting my own light here I can't see what I'm doing now but I'll have to, <laughs> have to come this way here a bit and I'll have to move it round that's not good it's still wet oh Sonia because it's bubbling it's pulling it up where it's wet pushing out all the paper together I don't have time for making letting it dry Oh no, 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 no. I suppose it doesn't matter if it's going on the inside. As long as it's not pulling down the outside, this outside bit. But we don't have to worry about that a lot because that's going to be covered over anyway when we come to that. But still, you might like to wait for yours to dry a bit because mine's a little bit still wet from the glue. It's going to, and it's dragging it, dragging the paper with it. Maybe I could lay it down flat like that, it might not. I don't know, it could be the way I'm cutting it out, eh? They got not got through, and I didn't turn my um, timer on, did I? No, of course not. <laughs> oh dear me! Oh, now I've got nothing. I better put it on, I suppose. I don't think I've been on here ten minutes, have I? Anyway, I'm going to try not to go for too long, so we can not have to have it cut out. Now do the very best you can, you know, stick to the line if you can. I'm finding you have to press down a bit too, because if you don't, it's not going to cut through. You've only got two thicknesses, but it just depends how thick your paper is that you put on it, because you can use scrapbooking paper or um, any, any sort of paper you can put on top of it. And you just make sure you press down and not just go along. You've got to push down as well. It's going along glasses <laughs> digging into my face now that's not good okay it's strange how things always happen to you when you try and do it now you got that now you've got that bit look in a hole it's not too bad it's not too bad because I've got um, I'm going to put some ink on this I'm going to actually ink it if I can find well I will be able to I love the green one that I use but do I need to use some vintage photo just for the day? Do you think? Oh, well, I'll go with green. I might go. I might go with the green. Where's my vintage photo anyway? Not handy, so I'll do this one. I'll do the green. Oh, here's the fin. Got to get the right colour stick. <laughs> or doing thing or whatever it is. Needs the right colour, don't you? I might have enough on there. Might not have to put any more on it. I'll have a look at that. Yeah, I'm quite partial to this. I, I, I don't need to do there. Do need to do here though. And so where I've got that spare white space, which is not actually white, it's a good cream colour because it's vintage. These books were in the 30s. They were published in the 30s, these ones. So <coughs> I'm using it. 
I can think that'll be vintage. Right. There's all different things that you like this, you know, for vintage, retro. A few others that I can't say. <laughs> right, now I'll do around in here. But I don't think I'm going to be able to see that when I'm finished, I don't know yet. Okay. Right. So we've got a hole now. And when I close that, I've got that torn there. So, you're not going to be able to see it. You're not going to be able to see that, so I'm not going to panic about that. So I still can't stick it together yet, so let's just um, get on with the next bit. I want to put something around the edge of it and I don't know what that will be. What about this? Will this work? I don't know yet. It could do. Maybe. Oh. Well, hang on a minute. Let's get, the, let's get some tulle first. We're going to put some tulle in there, don't you think? Right, and that'll be... What colour? I would have green over there for sure, but not in this little box where I've got a small bit of stuff. It's not going to matter because it isn't going to show up that much. It's not going to show up that that um, much what colour's in it. Right. You won't be able to see it that plain when it's un unrolled. It just doesn't show up that plain. I put all these in little bundles <laughs> and tried to go down to that amount in that box and then I managed to collect up another great big box full so I couldn't do it. I just failed seriously. I did. I failed seriously. I don't want to get rid of me things. I'm going to keep me things. I have to keep me things. They're part of my life. I go, <laughs> go and collect up stuff. I've got to do. And then I try to recycle, build things out of whatever I've collected. I'm going to just cut this up here willy-nilly so I can get off here. We'll be here all day. Right. Here we go. Very good. I've got two thicknesses of it, so I only need one. Only need one. And I'm going to... How did I put that in there first? I didn't, did I? No. Okay. So I'm going to actually put this into here because I want to put a picture in there. So when I do that though, this is going to be... You're going to be able to see that. So I know you're not because I'm going to put a picture in there. Right. I think this is going to be the picture. I think. If I can get hold of it. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes, that's in. That's the picture. And this is only on. This is on a piece of paper, like a piece of writing paper. Oh dear! I have to cut it big enough. I don't think I did. I don't think I did. I think I went really wild there and missed it. Look at that. Missed by a mile. Oh, I hope you got more of that somewhere soon. Somewhere seriously funny though. The chill. I don't know how many times I cut the chill before and it fell on the floor on me. Now where did I get that paper from? Oh my goodness me, I must have some more here. I just got it from here a while ago. I thought, oh well, this is nice, I'll have that. Yep. Oh dear. And now it's disappeared. I usually put all that stuff together. There is more of it. <laughs> of course, this has happened. You know how you think you, and you think you're all prepared and ready to go. <laughs> and I can't find. Ah <laughs> oh dear, I need to put that in there. I want that flower. I think I want that flower, don't I? Or a bird? No, flower. That flower. I can't do it. It's cut too far over. Isn't it? Look, yes. Way. Oh, Sonia. 
one should always measure okay don't do what I do please measure measure what you're doing first there was more paper here like that I know I've got more paper like that I know I do if only I could see them I'd be really excited mm. okay so we've got different sorts of things here I could probably have a go at something new different maybe what do you think so you want to try something different huh? no, no. let's have a look at this this is a piece of wrapping paper that I they look really cute don't they uh, it's sort of not really what I was looking for Anyway, just give me a second, please. I will be back with you with something any second now. I will find a piece of paper to put in there, or a picture of some sort. Picture of some sort. Put in it. Something I like. Because you have to like what you're doing. But it doesn't work for you. Isn't that right? I have a whole packet of that paper, that flower, right? And it just, when I got it, it just looked, oh, this looks really good. I thought, now that'll work, won't it? I found it this morning. I thought, now that's what I need. And now, it's not even anywhere near me no more. <laughs> What's that? No, 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 no. What have I done, Sonia? What have you done with it? It is terrible. Sorry everybody. I really am. Now I'm gonna knock everything down. Oh you clever. <laughs> oh dear me. <laughs> well it wouldn't be me if I didn't muck everything up with it. <laughs> oh dear. Oh goodness gracious me, where it what happened to that flower? Oh what about that one? There's a flower there. It's not going to fit in a hole, the hole's too big. It's not going to fit in a hole. And it's got you on there. It looks nice. It looks nice. Well, see, I wanted to show that because I thought, you know, you can put other things there behind it as well. You know, you can put some, spark some sparkly stuff on it, I guess. And you can put some sequins in there if you like. I didn't want to do sequins because that'll just fit at a squeeze. This will just squeeze in there, okay? So I'll squeeze this one in. It's a card that, um... Oh, dear, 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 I forgot her name. Now, that's not good. Uh, she got... <laughs> lady got me. Diane? Is it Diana? <coughs> So that way is good. This way you're just going to cut a bit off here. Not too much, Sonia. Not too much. That work? Only just. That's only just going to go on there. So I'm going to try and stick this down a tiny bit before I put the card on it. Um, and see if that'll... It should hold the, the tool in parts. It won't take me that long to put the... Are we still in the shot? Okay. I hope we always were. Come on. I suppose I'll find that paper in a minute too when I finish here doing this. Uh, come out. Well, I put some little bits and pieces behind the other one I did and I didn't like it. Some, some little. Uh, come on, glue. Ah, <laughs> uh, dear. You know, that didn't happen to me before. You knew it not So, not good. <laughs> It didn't happen when you just went here. Here we go. Round we go. Round we go. Okay. We've done that. Very good. So now <coughs> I'm going to put on this <coughs> dobby bits of glue off here. Is this the piece I wanted? I don't think so. This is all bent, this bit, isn't it? Another bit should be on the floor. Here it is. Alright. I knew where it went. Okay. So I'm going to put that on there like so. And 
you put a you could put a bird or a chook or something behind it, couldn't you? Which way's which way's up? About that. I mean, I think we might have to go this way somehow. That's better. That looks better, doesn't it? Don't you think? Right. And I know that it does not fit, but I'm going to put more glue around here and I'm gonna I'm gonna put a trim around the front of it so you're not gonna see that that's not fitting there, okay? Because I made a mistake and cut the wrong thing and then wrecked it and you have to try and do something about what you ruined, don't you? So this is going behind here and it's gonna be in the centre there sort of like so right we got it without okay all right stick that down yeah so this would be nice with um if you wanted to put the, the sparkly things behind it but i didn't like it like that i'm afraid i was not maybe because i didn't have if you got nice little colored ones i haven't got anything oh yes i have oh what am i talking about of course i have I've got a draw for them <laughs> Isn't it amazing how much stuff that we have and we don't even remember and I'm not even thinking, you know, properly because I do have, I do have that, so, so I do, sparkly stuff you put in there. I'll have to show you this in a minute because I can't believe I, and you probably would have seen, seen it before anyway. I'll push this up a tiny bit so it'll, that turn over, right. Bit further, you've got to look at these things, and I didn't. When you get flustered when you're doing something, it all seems to go wrong, then doesn't it? <laughs> right, okay, yes, and that'll go there, and that'll go there like that. And I think that looks very effective. So now I need to put some trim around the outside of it so it won't look like a you won't be able to see all the ratty bits that I didn't get right. Should we go like this and put the trim around the outside? I don't know if I want to do the flower thing that I had before. I think I might do this thing here. I might wear some wipes to get the stuff off the top of this thing. Stuff off the top here. So we've still got a bit of ways to go on this, but we've still not been that long, so that's okay. So I'm just going to put a bit around here to start with, just a tiny bit to get on going because I need to turn this uh, trim as I go. I don't want to be, um, I don't want to have the, are we going in ways? Yes, we're going in ways. I don't know. We're going in, in ways. <laughs> we're having this bit in the, in the mid, going towards the middle, okay, to give that a, you know, a nice effect on there, I think. But you only need to put a bit on at a time because you don't want to... I mean, hair's hanging down in my eyes now. I don't know how that could be because I did have it tied up. But the wind, I've got the breeze blowing on me. So <laughs> Everything's getting a bit untoward here. We're well, good, though. We're good. I just almost coming in here to do this. I really did. But every day, I think I, I can't do this. I just don't feel, don't feel up to it. Didn't know what I was going to do, but just didn't feel up to it either. You know? And I've, um, I don't know, I've been learning a bit about stuff. I don't know if I could learn anything any good, though, that, that I can do. I just went and did a bit of, you didn't watch much, went to sleep mostly. I mean, it was always going to sleep, kept going to sleep. But that's okay, isn't it? We, we've got to get some rest so we can get up and keep going, don't we? Is this right? I got that going properly. Let me see, I need to peep it that close up. A little bit closer to see this. What have I done here? This right? You're going around in a circle. You're bringing a tiny bit there, I think. That's what I think. There's people out there mowing everywhere. Hubby mowed when he came back from up the town because he had to go up the street. He mowed, he mows every second day, I think. Keep that long yarn. <laughs> Looking good. A few other things I wish I could talk them into, but anyway, it's supposed to, it'll all happen. It'll all come eventually. You gotta 
don't mind how you handle things sometimes. Sometimes men have got to have their own ideas and think they do it was their own idea anyway, don't they? They always think. <laughs> ah, well. He loves his garden. I don't know who's mowing now. Must be the man across the road or the next door. Could possibly be Jeremy's already done his. He's going to do it twice, surely. Now, there's a... There's a join there that we can see really obvious, right? That's a really obvious join, so we're going to have to put something on that. Now, I thought I'd press this down nice and firm, but obviously I haven't done enough squishing, enough squishing down. Oh, this part here where that where that um, piece was, that's not going really nice, is it? Now, are we ready to do the sealing up of the thing? Have we finished that bit or not? Because we don't want to seal it and turn it into the envelope thing unless we've finished what we're doing, do we? Now we can't because this here is not right. It's too far over the edge and it's on an angle. Well, it's not a, yeah, well, it's not it's not straight enough for me. I don't like it. You've got to cut more off here. You've got to cut more off, Sonia. Just very carefully, though. Because this is very thick, this card, it's stopping that from bending up nicely. So we're going to get them scissors and we're going to deal to it. I'm going to deal too much and wreck it. Okay. So when you do yours, don't do what I'm doing. <laughs> These bad bits. Now, does it work? Is it going to be straight across the bottom? I hope so. Looking all right, it might be. Yes, I think it could be good. Could be good. This bit here, though, could be a bit wacky, <laughs> a bit wonky. Okay, so do you think it's time now for us to glue that? Oh, these bits, not the not the, not the packet. We don't shut that. We don't shut that up. We're going to cut these off here, though. The glue off. And glue bits of stick on it. This bit off. We want to put something in the envelope. This one, you probably could just put in a, on a paper clip and stick it to the side of your journals you know so you can just put bits and pieces into it if you want to because it'll probably be too thick too wide to go into a journal anyway if you do the same thing I did you can do it on a and cut it right down to a small thing and just put that in the small part couldn't you you know I've, I don't even think this bit here doesn't seem right it seems a little bit on the skew whiff side me but anyway so now what do we need else we need something because this is really really white and bare isn't it bare <laughs> really white and bare what what have I got that I can stick over there to stop it from being like that it'll be a nice and white and bare thing <laughs> that looks cool that doesn't look too bad does it Okay, maybe if you put it there, it wouldn't look like you were trying to cover it over. <laughs> maybe not much, but it probably would. Let me see, what else have I got that I can probably use there? Uh, so I don't think, I'm, I think I can close it, eh? You think we can stick it down? Right, so let's glue this here bit. With a bit of, bit of claggy old glue, that wasn't a good idea, but it should flatten out and I squish it. It should flatten out for me, I hope, when I squish it down. There we go. Righto. Push that down. Shut. And this bit here. Now, if you wanted... Oh, well, you couldn't really... See, you could, if you need to use it, you're going to have to pin it onto... Pin it onto something so you can see this bit, right? Because otherwise... Oh, I guess you could leave that flap off there or something and but that's not the way the idea of the thing works is it that's not what I really had in mind to do so we'll get something to stick on there eh? we need a, we need a stamp we need an envelope you need to have a stamp don't you so let's try a stamp <laughs> and everything else is going to fall out of the cupboard on me righto so we've got real ones and we've got fake ones haven't we Oh no, we're going to have nothing in a minute. Oh crikey. 
Okay. What do I want to put on there? I don't know, I can't see nothing yet. What's this one? I don't even know what it's got pictures of on there really, to be honest. That's a nice one. Pretty colours. Peoples. And peoples on there. Maybe I'm going to stamp the whole side of it with stamps. What do you reckon? Just put stamps on the other edge. Do it in a nice way though, like it's... Um, I'll show you. I hope I do it nicely. Okay, so we've got that one there. Right, and flower. These are nice, aren't they? I like those. I think I might use real ones. They're fake. That's a nice one, isn't it? Is it going to going to interfere with this one over here? No, it's not. It looks all right, doesn't it? I think. When I look back at it in a minute, I'll tell you. Sometimes we have to have two looks, see what it's like. Have looks and see. Right. Sorry. I'm just fishing through here. How about that? That looks better. I don't mind that at all. Hang on. And that. Wait a minute. Okay. Got another thing that's something like that. Uh, fruits. Okay. And another thing. Another one. Have we got another one? that one here I suppose I'm not real keen on putting the red colours on it I really want it to stay um, with the green and yellowy colours so that's what I'm after that's what I'm looking for green and yellowy colours there we go that one, oops, come back here It's a thinking thing, isn't it? Something you need to put, put, put some thought into. I know it's not, um, but it's detail. You've got to, you've got to be in the, you've got to be, do the detail of things. Oh, look at this! I like that one. I really do like that one. That is really nice. That is really nice. Uh, I wish it stopped blowing away. It'd be a lot easier for me if they did. I'm thinking. Uh huh. I like these ones too. These look really good, don't they? I do like those. Yes, I do like these. We'll have a look at this, see what they look like. So I like that stamp. I'm gonna put that on there. And then I might and then I might leave it oh because I because I think I might put a some sort of a tie around it or something. I don't know. Close it up. You reckon? I'm trying to get the glue off my hand. Sorry about this. Okay, so maybe now I should go because I don't want it to be too long. And I'll come back and because I want to stamp that. I'm going to put the stamp there, okay? And I don't know whether I'm going to put some colour along the rest of it or not. Because see. When I don't put things like that, I think to myself, well, you can journal on them spots anyway, can't you? You don't have to, um, you 
can you can journal on the spots that's got nothing that's got nothing written there or nothing on the in its road you know like it's, if it's empty you just put some journaling on it you don't have to um have every space covered up you'd still be writing on there couldn't you yes i might leave that like it is and i'm going to wrap something around here um if this is long enough is it yeah of course it is it's still connected to its own piece all right and so i'm going to wrap this around it and i think i'm going to call that finished i don't i don't think i need to put anything else on that because i'm gonna i might need to put some um bit more ink on it though. I'll have to see if I want to ink it a bit. What do you reckon? I don't want to over ink it and wreck it. I just don't want to do that. I just like it like it is. I want to go, I don't want to go too far because then people can journal on that. You can get a nice paper clip and put on there and fasten it in your journal. And I think that looks really cool. I do like it. I'm not um, disappointed with the outcome at all. I'm thinking about putting something else on it so we'll see what happens. So thank you for watching everybody and I'll talk to you later. Bye bye.